Triple Charm. Hi. Hi. Thanks so much for having us. Thanks so much for being here. Tell me all the things. What's going on with you guys? We're, we're just, great. We're just yeah. living life. But <laughs> it's been a lot of fun this past few months. We've released two songs, mm-hmm. one over the summer and one about a month ago. So it's mm-hmm. been going great, creating content on social media always and mm-hmm. writing new music. So it's Will been you- fun. All right, I want you to rank all three, all right? Writing music, creating content, and putting out songs. What is the, what is number three? Oh, that's so okay. hard. Writing music. And you, guys, oh. and, and you guys have to come together as a group to give me the answers. And, which is- okay, okay. okay. Music, creating content. <laughs> what was the last option? Writing music, creating content, and... Putting songs out. Releasing. Yeah. Okay, well, I'd have to say releasing the music is on top because i mean getting okay. to, getting okay. to put that out okay. Okay. that's okay. like mm-hmm. that's like yeah. the best part is sharing it with everybody because mm-hmm. okay okay so, i agree and then definitely definitely songwriting second i mean that has <laughs> to be up there yeah, I, think. I think so i think so but that doesn't mean they're all like not equal i would that say just means it's like, very close you know? Okay, no. I'll, I'll say that. No, I, mean, I think creating content is like a huge part of that's true. Yeah, that's a huge, yeah. So I don't know. Okay, maybe that's we'll hard. do it in the order in which it would occur. So on okay. the bottom, we have writing music. Okay. Then mm-hmm. Creating content mm-hmm. and then releasing. So number one is releasing. Yeah. I yeah. Mean, okay. That's not good, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what's interesting? It, it has to be great working with your sisters and coming together and putting songs out, right? Like, what what are you guys, how do you guys come together and start these writing sessions? It's great. It's so much fun. Sometimes we'll come up with different concepts and go to the room next door, knock on the door and be like, hey, right now, hey, Gabby, I came up with something. You want to hear it? So sometimes it happens like that. And then other times we have a studio in our mm-hmm. house and so we'll do like sessions over zoom mm-hmm. with our producer which are always a lot of fun but, but it's yeah. great working mm-hmm. with your sisters because mm-hmm. yes we live together so <laughs> yeah. anytime so bonus <laughs> yeah anytime we need to get something done you know we can do it if it's 12 a.m we'll do it i mean yeah, yeah there's no and then also we can be very honest with each other there's yes, no hard that, feeling yes, about hurting at the end of the day we love each other so there you go. <laughs> it's really interesting. I love that you guys think like that because you know, my I feel like the one person that you can really be honest with is definitely your sibling. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like, for sure. Yeah, yep. sure. And it's not even anything drawn out. Like with my brother, it'll be like, You're wearing that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Yeah. Exactly. I got you. Exactly. Yeah. So the inspiration, does that hit at all times of ours or no? Yeah, yeah, at the ra- most random times, I feel like yeah. for me, we can be <laughs> me and Gabby like to go on walks around yeah. the neighborhood, and then sometimes <laughs> Molly will join. But yeah. you know, it, sometimes inspiration will hit yeah. on a walk, yes. or we see like a sign or something, just a quote, like yeah. any honestly, anytime. Mm-hmm. How did you guys come together as a group? Like, when did you guys discuss this and say, you know what, let's start singing, let's start doing things? Yes. So we officially formed mm-hmm. Triple Charm in 2019, mm-hmm. but we all three grew up around music. We grew up doing competitive dance. So our first time performing together was actually when we were only like we were all under the age of six. Yeah. Was yeah. the first oh. time we performed together. Yep. For a dance competition. <laughs> so we've been performing for a long time, but in 2019 is when we officially decided to mm-hmm. form the group. And I'd say yeah. Amalia was like the pioneer of the group. <laughs> Mm Because she was into musical theater. Mm -hmm. And so she started singing and me and Gabby were kind of on the sidelines cheering her on. (laughs) Yeah. But then there reached a point where I guess we just, we'd watched Amalia do it for so long. Mm -hmm. We, we wanted to join in on the fun. So then once we were all three doing it, it felt like the natural thing to do do it together. together. (laughs) Yeah. Who's the, who's the older sister? I'm the oldest. Clearly, 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 clearly. You give me older sister vibes i feel like you'd probably <laughs> be bossing them around that wasn't right let's do it again are you like that oh my gosh i mean I, depends you're not on the wrong day. <laughs> yeah. Actually, i'm pretty self-aware and i know that if anyone's the one that wants to make us do it again it's usually me yeah, yeah. reyna is definitely this Detail also oriented. comes into the roles of triple charm and like what we each have strengths in so right is super detail oriented mm-hmm. and so she's in charge of editing and posting our videos because yeah so we each have different strengths so Raina yeah. most of the time is the one that's like okay we need to I run like, it back I, like, I again. consider myself I'm the quality control I make sure that it's yes. good and we yeah. don't stop until it's good enough 
And yeah. Amalia is the nice, like efficient. Yeah, efficient. I'm trying to get it done. <laughs> counterbalance. So we don't go too yeah. long focusing on one thing, but we also make sure we get it right. Yeah. What about Gabriella? Like, what are you? <laughs> She's very easygoing. She's like yeah. the mediator between the two. Yeah. And then also when it comes down to like which decision we end up with, Gabby's the one that will like tiebreaker. Yeah. Is, is is Gabby the youngest? Yes. Yep. yep. Yes. 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 I totally <laughs> you can agree. tell. Yeah, absolutely. Because I feel like it's it's just like all in order. Like the way how, you know, quality control and and, yep. and the boss of the group. Like I totally mm-hmm. feel the vibes and stuff like that. And you know what's interesting? I love that it works. Like it works for you guys. Yeah. It yes. does. We've gotten into a rhythm. We've had a few years yeah. to work on it, but now mm-hmm. I feel like it's smooth sailing. Yeah. How do you guys manage being on uh social media right now? It's so yeah. much fun. We are all do online school, so yeah. it, we have a lot of time to create mm-hmm. content basically all day, every day. Mm-hmm. But it's a lot of fun. We stay consistent. We try and do 10 reels a week and then a short every day. And then obviously posting on TikTok, mm-hmm. things like that. So I'd say the best mm-hmm. advice I would give is to like, remember what's real and what's not. So mm-hmm. as much as like social media is real, mm-hmm. not all of it actually affects your life. Mm-hmm. So yeah. like for me, I can get caught up like watching other people. Mm-hmm. And so we are kind of the, we have like the role of the creator, mm-hmm. but it's easy to get caught up in consuming, mm-hmm. just like being on there and yeah. posting. Yeah. Then you yeah. start scrolling and it's yeah. like, yeah. whoa. I just so, left an hour. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's also important for us to like, remember you know, what's actually real and tangible. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I love that you guys have that discernment because I feel like a lot of people will take social media, what they see on Instagram, what they see on TikTok as Bible. And the fact that you guys can differentiate and know that this is not real, this is pretend, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. the fact that you guys can do that. I think that, that that's amazing. Exactly. And then one thing we also always try to do with our social media is make it a positive place for people. So yeah. We're always there to cheer people up. We get the nicest comments yeah. mm-hmm. almost every day saying, you put a smile on my face. You mm-hmm. cheered me up today. So that's always been our goal since day mm-hmm. one is to spread yeah. a positive message. So we're very happy that we get to do it on social media. <gasps> that's so great. 10 reels. You guys do 10 a week? Yeah. 10 we- to 12. Depends on the week. Yeah. How the hell? <laughs> it's like a full-time it's, thing. It's a full-time sure. gig we've got going Yeah. On. It's so funny because I was putting together one uh, today with my boss earlier and I was like, I I have no idea how people do this time and time again. Like this would frustrate me. And and, and it has to be not necessarily frustrating, but it's it's work constantly feeding the beast. You know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. I mean, I would say at the end of the day, when you see all the fans just coming in Mm -hmm. and just saying like, I love you guys so much. Watching these videos puts a smile on my face and like, you guys are the best. I love watching you. You know, I want to see your content every day. Keep yeah. going. Yeah. And like all those empowering comments like really gets me and I'm like, yes. yeah, this we is gotta keep going. Yeah. super motivating to keep going. Yeah, absolutely. That just, I, I feel like that would definitely make it all seem worth it. Yeah, absolutely. exactly. So tell me about Don't Need a Reason. Yes. yes. <laughs> so that's our most recent single that we just mm-hmm. released. And it has a more Latin vibe. Mm -hmm. We wanted to get more in touch with our Latin roots because we're 50% Puerto Rican. Mm -hmm. So it's a little bilingual. There's some Spanish in there. And it's all about the power of dance because Mm -hmm. we grew up as dancers. Mm -hmm. And that's a big part of our lives and Hispanic culture. Yeah. So we we wanted wanted to to... marry the two. We thought it'd be a perfect connection point between our culture and something we're passionate about. So yeah we hope it has you up on your feet yes it's very very fun (laughs) where where are you guys from we're from orlando florida born and raised yeah nice you know what's funny i so i grew up on the east coast and i i grew up with like all my puerto rican cousins that i went to school with and whatnot and it's so funny because they would go to orlando or miami and whatnot to to like for the summer and whatnot and then they had cousins that lived down there so i was like i just want to make sure you know what i'm saying yeah Yeah, that's us (laughs) we're over here on the east coast (laughs) we love that so let us know what are you working on next yeah. New yes. music. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. Yes. I'm excited. Definitely new music. Of course, creating content always. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, yeah. And then our YouTube channel, we're building yes. that up. 
more long form videos because mm -hmm. that's been a big request for us yeah. to kind of get to know us even more past mm -hmm. the shorter videos so yeah we're excited for that and yeah yeah lots of new music yeah stay tuned <laughs> yeah. absolutely was it hard to because you know i think my biggest issue with uh, social media is thinking about what people are thinking as they're watching the video or what people are going to say on the comments was that hard to let that go mm, that's an interesting question yeah. i feel like for me personally the comments have never been something that's affected me too much so whether it's like a hate comment or something very nice for me it's kind of you don't want to define you know? yes yeah exactly so that's yeah. something that I've always kind of been good at I guess mm -hmm. it hasn't ever really had a big effect on me so I haven't mm -hmm. really had to struggle with that or kind of figure out how to navigate that right and I think we're all I kind of we're the all same yeah that way. similar in that way yeah mm -hmm. do you ever delete <laughs> yeah. them or do you ever clap back or no <laughs> I mean oh. there's nothing really worth clapping back to yeah. at least quite yet yeah. if it's because if it's just yeah. someone who's having a bad day I'd feel yeah. bad yeah. To, to like, even go there yeah. you guys are so much better than me because it would be me <laughs> all day nothing, yeah. but, nothing but all of that you feel me yeah yeah, yeah. but also <laughs> where you focus it's like yeah. It, it builds up so if you mm -hmm. focus on responding to the positive then yes that's something then we up. always focus on for the first hour every single post we reply right. to comments mm -hmm. so I think it starts spreading the love mm -hmm. yeah it's important to us to like engage with our audience too yeah so, for sure but it's fun guys thank you so much for joining this was a delight you guys did a great job thank you so much for uh coming on and chatting with us yes thank, thank you so you much for having us. us of course thank you